Queen of Tears is too literal for its name. Each episode wrings tears from the viewer's eyes. The evil Unsong is on it again. At the end of the recently concluded episode 14, Unsong framed Hyun Wu for Mr. Pyong's murder, so as to be with Hayin. Despite Hayin's memory loss, she still remembers Hyun Wu's name, but she thinks he's her ex-husband because of Un Song's lies. A confused Hayin can be seen cautious with her family after returning to Korea. The Avengers will assemble to help clear Hyun Wu's name. With memories of her time with Hyun Wu haunting her dreams, Hayin will visit Hyun Wu in jail. Meanwhile, Un Song had been the one who killed Mr. Pyong, and he was behind the accident in Germany. Finally, his day of reckoning is near, as Biamja's investigators followed Hayin and Hyun Wu to Germany, and has evidence of his crimes. What's more, Hyun Wu will finally exact revenge by proving Un Song's investment fraud. The sad thing is that Hayin will stick with Un Song thinking they're in a relationship. But running into Hyun Wu keeps making her heart flutter. Meanwhile, Su Chiol is going to get badly hurt for trying to protect Da Hai. After Hyun Wu takes care of Un Song, he can be seen waiting for Hayin at the aquarium, where he first proposed to her. How anxious are you for the next episode? Stick around for a complete review, recap, and explanation. Thanks for watching, bye.